How Users Build Their Own Blockchain Systems and Applications How do users build their own blockchain systems and applications? For this problem, this article introduces the corresponding analysis and answers in detail, hoping to help more friends who want to solve this problem find a simpler and easier way. Since the birth of Bitcoin in 2009, the accompanying blockchain technology has unknowingly developed into a complete technological ecosystem. In the current blockchain ecology, it mainly includes three categories, the underlying technology and infrastructure layer, the general application and platform layer, and the industry application layer. 1. The underlying technology and infrastructure layer mainly include technologies such as network programming, distributed algorithms, encrypted signatures, and data storage. Through these technologies, the network environment, transaction channels, and node reward rules can be formulated. 2. The general application and platform layer includes smart contracts, information security, anti-counterfeiting traceability, fast calculation, etc. The blockchain platform can be divided into public chains, alliance chains, and private chains according to the degree of decentralization and different application scenarios. 3. The industry application layer is applying blockchain technology to different scenarios through the deployment and use of DAP. Today, a large number of companies are involved in different parts of the blockchain ecology, and they are forming an increasingly complete ecosystem through cooperation and complementarity. Next, the editor will take you to fully understand the current status of the current blockchain ecological development. It all starts with Bitcoin. Once Bitcoin came out, its characteristics are very distinctive. Not controlled by any central organization, transactions need to be publicly confirmed by the entire network, everyone is equal before the algorithm, and everyone and every node can participate and supervise. These characteristics of Bitcoin also make it fundamentally different from other virtual currencies. On this basis, a series of blockchain underlying technologies including distributed algorithms, encrypted signatures, and data storage have gradually developed. Later, people discovered that these technologies are not only applicable to Bitcoin, but also can be used in other application scenarios. Value As a result, common technologies and applications such as smart contracts, information security, Distributed computing and storage around these underlying technologies began to be integrated into the blockchain ecosystem. With these technologies as the foundation, blockchain platforms are gradually differentiated into public chains, alliance chains, and private chains according to different application scenarios. Different blockchain platforms have differences in access mechanisms, consensus algorithms, and many other aspects. The public chain is vividly described as the operating system of the blockchain world. It not only allows nodes to join the network freely, but also all nodes have the authority to view ledger information. The most widely used public chain platform is Ethereum. However, the industry is also seeking new breakthroughs in the underlying technology of the public chain, exploring a more universal and stable public chain platform and defining the next era based on this type of platform as blockchain 3.0. Consortium chains are usually used between government agencies, commercial organizations, and companies. Nodes can only join after being authorized through the access mechanism. Different nodes have different information viewing permissions. The private chain is all closed, the participating nodes are only limited, and the data access and use have strict management authority. Only blockchain technology is used for bookkeeping, the right to bookkeeping is not public, and only internal transactions are recorded, which are exclusively enjoyed by companies or individuals. DAP ecology may drive the blockchain into the 3.0 era. Today, with the rapid development of blockchain technology, especially the underlying platform technology, various fields are rapidly carrying out prototype design and functional testing of blockchain applications until the final product is launched, which has detonated the development of DAP to a certain extent. The so-called DAP, that is, decentralized application, decentralized application, also known as distributed application, is considered to be the initiator of the 3.0 era of blockchain. Different from the apps we are familiar with, DAPs are various distributed applications derived from the ecology of the underlying blockchain platform and are also basic service providers in the blockchain world. 
At present, the most prosperous DAP ecology is still the Ethereum platform. As of June this year, the Ethereum platform has more than 1,600 DAPs, such as the world's first blockchain game CryptoKitties, the Ethereum wallet IM token, and the social chat application YeCall. In addition to Ethereum, other underlying platforms have also successively derived their own distinctive application ecology, with their own typical dApps, such as Steemit based on the Steam platform, Wank Cloud based on the Thunder chain, and GX Talk based on the GX chain. Dapps based on blockchain technology are still in the early stage of exploration, and most dapps are immature in product design. In many dapp ecosystems, there is no explosive dapp that can compete with traditional apps, and the user volume is relatively low. But it is undeniable that the huge imagination brought by the blockchain technology, especially the continuous investment in the blockchain field by companies such as Baidu, is laying the foundation for the prosperity of the entire ecology. In order to promote the development of blockchain ecology, Baidu officially released the SuperChain system, SuperChain, not long ago, enabling developers to quickly create and publish their own dApps and distribute them to the SuperChain app through the SuperChain developer platform. Dapps in the ecosystem can take advantage of Baidu's traffic advantages to obtain traffic, accurately connect developers and users through content and service recommendations, and create an autonomous and co-prosperous blockchain distribution ecological service. Here are the answers to how users build their own blockchain systems and applications. I hope the above content can be of some help to you. If you still have many doubts that have not been solved, you can pay attention to ISU Cloud Industry Information Channel for more information.